I'm just imagining the judge <laughs> with the like the the meme of like the smiley face puzzle that's just like two huge pieces. Like, all right, smart guy, <laughs> let's see you take a crack at it. <laughs> <laughs> Fuck. On my way from the sage, so I heard them. I heard the faint sound of the gunshot and stopped. I heard another. There's the smell of gunpowder. I knew I must tell someone, but I was in a hurry, so I kept moving past this moment. Do you want to ask why she was in a hurry? I mean, I'm assuming it's because, it's because of the magic she had trick, to get. But yeah, it's the magic trick. You were in a hurry to go where? I was on my way to the backstage exit, as I have said. Why were you in a such a hurry then? Well, I don't think that has anything to do with this case. <laughs> it very well might. Please answer the question. Are you all right, Lamiwa? Yes. Yes. I am just tired. Recall what I told you yesterday, Herr Forehead. Lamiwa suffers from serious amnesia. Please refrain from traumatizing her further. Okay. Oh my god. Come on. Uh, what? So we Does can that just... mean that she forgets things that happened yesterday? That's not no, how amnesia not... works. What, so he thinks he can just dismiss questions he thinks are too traumatizing? Tell us to Edgeworth and... That uh, yeah, case. the time when he actually <laughs> traumatized <Adrian> somebody. <laughs> Hold on, if you're about to say that I'm <laughs> traumatizing you, let me preempt you by saying, I don't care. No. uh -huh. <laughs> <laughs> Why don't you prove her reason had a connection to the case before asking about it, yeah? The prosecution's objection is sustained. Current question is moot. Mr. Justice, please continue with your cross examination. Lamiwa was attacked because of this testimony. I know she was, so something's gotta be hidden here. Maybe there's some detail we're missing. I guess we'll just have to get her to fill in the blanks. Oh, like a mad lib. <laughs> Lamiwa, right. please make something up. <laughs> <laughs> Let me work. You know, you, like you've been doing up until now. Can you give me an <laughs> adjective? Bloody. <laughs> and now a noun? Body. <laughs> <laughs> oh, that's good. That's good. That'll be really funny. Uh, maybe tell us what they said. Hold it! Darian Crescent. I did not know his name at the time. But yes, it was him, the one who took the stand yesterday. How many times do I need to remind you that's impossible? There is no way you could have heard him. Because the window with the scene was closed? Is that why? Of course. Apollo! If we keep asking the same questions as yesterday, we won't get anywhere. She's right. Maybe there's a different angle I can try. Uh, uh, yeah, what were they talking about? Lamuar, do you by any chance remember what they were saying to each other? If so, please tell us. I have given it much reflection, but... I was afraid of this. She doesn't remember. I remember exactly what they were saying. <laughs> <laughs> I only heard one phrase clearly. A whole phrase? You remember something that was said? Why didn't you say anything yesterday? You never asked. <laughs> <laughs> Though my memory is clear, I was afraid to speak. You see, I do not understand what was said. This could be it. Clue I've been waiting for. Well, what it did he say? That, it seemed that Darian was saying banana. <laughs> no. <laughs> God. <laughs> it was the other man speaking, not Mr. Latus. The shooter then. Darian crescend. Well, what did he say? It's over. Press the switch now. Okay. He said, <laughs> uh, he said, don't ever make fun of my shark persona ever again. <laughs> <laughs> you have no idea who that could be. <laughs> yeah, uh, 
<laughs> Romaine Latour is just standing there like, is that your fursona? That's so cringe. <laughs> Please, they're called... <laughs> it's called a fin <laughs> Switch? Nintendo? Metal Gear? <laughs> and the shooter said this to the victim, Mr. Latouse. Mr. Latouse. <laughs> <laughs> I thought it quite strange myself afterward. Hmm. It is a mystery. What could it possibly mean? Uh, Mr. Justice, uh, care to shed some light on this? Uh, uh, I mean, sure, I... It's, um, this is very, very vital. Maybe we could add that to the testimony. Maybe, Apollo? <laughs> oh. I know what this is about. Press the switch. Well, I'm assuming we're going to present the switch. We have switch. a switch. Yeah. To be All like, right, I got one. it. I'll press it. The remote Close up the trigger. trigger. Yeah. Objection! Nice. Okay, good. I was, I, I don't know what it is. Now, because we've had some that have like thrown us off, I, I get worried on the really obvious ones. It's going to be like, <laughs> no, it's not this one. And you're like, what? Press the switch. There's only one key that can unlock the mystery of those words. Oh. The Keyblade! No! Sorry, get out of here. Sorry, it's me. Yet there was nothing to seem that could be called a switch. Uh, say the light. True. There wasn't a switch at the scene. But it just so happens, I have a switch right here! The oh, phrasing of that. Mario Kart? <laughs> the phrasing of that is really funny. Of like, yeah, it's not really involved in the crime, but I did bring a thing that technically is a switch. <laughs> that certainly does look like a switch, doesn't it? The problem is, this was found I would not. Say it's more of a button than a switch. <laughs> this was found not at the scene of the crime, but on the stage. The stage. The concert was held, yes. This was found hidden there. On the stage. Are you claiming that the voice Lamiwar heard was of someone commanding another to press this switch? It's a possibility. Uh, her, her full back sprite looks really cool. You can see like all the constellations on that. I was gonna say, I thought Machi Tobias' full outfit looked pretty snazzy. Mm -hmm. when you they're saw they're, they're both dripped the out. Thing. Oh, her forehead? <laughs> I'd call that an impossibility. Why? It's hardly necessary for me to remind the court of the layout of the concert form. The stage is quite far from Lamiwa's dressing room. Not to mention that the governors were in the middle of a concert on said stage. We aren't known for being a quiet band. You could shout all you wanted and not be heard. The detective's voice was loud, but certainly not a shout. So, to have Herr Forehead's cries of possibility fallen far short of being heard. Sorry, but he wouldn't have needed to shout. Excuse me? You heard what I said. Or do you need me to shout it out for you? <laughs> shout, shout out, <laughs> let it all out. It would have been quite simple to be heard on the stage from that dressing room. Oh wait, you like evidence, don't you? How about this? Generally in a court, yes. <laughs> using, <laughs> it's preferred if possible. Using this, it would have been easy to get a message to someone on the stage from the dressing room. Yeah, yeah the earpiece. Uh, yes. There it is. Prosecutor Gavin, perhaps you're familiar with this? Why, that's... What? What is it? Use that to play TF2. <laughs> is that some new kind of newfangled phone they invented while I wasn't looking? God, I hate you. <laughs> I hate you so much, Judge. <laughs> Is that the iPhone 3? <laughs> We're on, like, the iPhone 20 at this point. What? 
This is the type. This is a type of transmitter, communications device. Transmitter? I hardly know her. <laughs> communications device. Metal Gear. Metal Gear. <laughs> <laughs> we can't keep getting away with this. Yeah, we really can't. <laughs> From what I heard that night, everyone on stage was wearing one of these. Isn't that right, Prosecutor Gavin? Uh, yes, actually. They're for talking between band members. We all had one on. So you admit that if you were wearing one of these, talking from the backstage to the stage would be simple! Attention! True, but wait! Those send out an electronic signal. To avoid interference with the audio systems, their range is quite limited. Mammy War said it was about 30 feet, right? Look at this cross-section diagram of the concert oh, form. Come on, Zach. Come on, Zach. Come on, Zach. Oh, sorry. I didn't understand what you meant. Look at this cross-section diagram of the forum! There you go. Perfect. Right uh, into the lyrics. Mm-hmm. <laughs> Didn't have to jam eight syllables in the span yep. of three. <laughs> <Yep>. <laughs> uh. Exactly. The walk from the stage to the backstage seems far. The direct distance is less than 30 feet. That can't be! So, when Lamiwar heard the shooter's voice, he... Was it been talking to someone on stage? Objection! Ah, you're claiming this is the switch in question? Why did it have to be one? Why did ha why did it have to be on the stage at the time? It could be placed in a pocket and carried anywhere. Someone could have hit it on the stage after the fact. Hey, he's got a point. How do we know where it was when she heard the voice? When the shooter said, press the switch. Well, I guess we don't. Hmm. An unfortunate situation. I'm afraid that until we know where this switch was, there's little point in debating it. Uh, I was sure this was the way to go with this. What is this switch anyway? We don't even know the base that basic fact. Oh, you're gonna love this one. <laughs> hey, hey, Clavier. Clavier, could you uh, could you hold this for me for a second? <laughs> oh man, you're gonna get pretty heated when you see what this one does. <laughs> Wait a second. I do oh, know I what this stop. switch is. Oh my head. <laughs> if you follow that train to its lot, uh, if you follow that train of logic to its incredible conclusion, it ends up in proof that completely changes this case. What's up, Apollo? The sun. Apollo? <laughs> we know about this switch, right? We know what it is. Y yeah. We can burn this place down to hell. We can get at it. <laughs> <laughs> Trucy, put it under the bench and activate it. <laughs> It'll buy some more time. Well, think of when it was used that day. Think of what happened. Well, Mr. Justice, if you have no further information to share concerning this switch... We do, we do. Your Honor! Yes, Mr. Justice? I've been remiss in not telling this, telling the court this before. I know what this switch is. Hmm. Well, it seems the defense is set upon linking this switch to the case. Let's see your evidence of the link. What evidence do you have to explain what this switch is? The switch suits a revolver. <laughs> Click bang, click bang. The videotape, let's watch it again. <laughs> Maybe everyone will fall asleep and we can make our getaway. <laughs> Prosecutor Gavin, you remember this? That's... that... that 
What? Is it another one of those newfangled phones? Look at it. How do you... This is an igniter. What phone looks like this? I igniter? You mean it's like a lighter? Yes, actually. Ah, I didn't think you'd get that. <laughs> you aren't saying this switch is a remote. I am. This is a remote trigger for an igniter. What? Look, I'll show you. <laughs> oh, 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 oh! Mr. Justice, you will cease and desist from burning down this courtroom. I like the idea yeah. that the judge was just like holding it right up to his face as it turned on and like it his singed beard. some of his beard. Yeah. <laughs> Uh, sorry, that was a bit more fire than I expected. If my whiskers had caught on fire. Ooh. Prosecutor Gavin, let me repeat myself. This switch is a remote ignite is, is a remote ignite trigger. Doesn't that suggest something to you? You're talking about what happened to me, aren't you? <sighs> exactly. That night at the concert, there was one unusual burst of flame. When your guitar caught on fire in the middle of your performance. Wasn't that part of the stage show, though? Now, quick question. Am I going to count that as us viewing the cutscene again? Because I don't think that should be counted. Because it's so short. Mm, yeah. yeah. I wouldn't count it, no. Okay. Yeah. There, there was also yeah. one before that I saw people saying in the chat that I should count. And I feel like that was, it was too short. Prosecutor Gavin had been ent was entirely unaware that such a thing had been planned. The guitar that burned was a valuable keepsake. That's right. He got it in Virginia from whoever you are. He said the sound was amazing. Before it burned, of course. Now it just kind of smokes. The better the guitar, the brighter it burns. Her forehead! Yes? Don't tell me you're trying to tie these two things together. I mean... Yeah. What, but, Those yes. being the shooter's voice heard by Lamiwa. And the guitar suddenly catching on fire. I mean, what do you think press the switch means? <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> we have a switch, your guitar caught on fire roughly the same time. Uh, I am. It's really simple when you think about it. Mr. Latouste and the shooter were at the crime scene. The shooter was wearing a headset. He ordered someone on stage to press the switch. The switch was pressed, and the guitar caught on fire. Well, that does seem to make sense. Though something about it is bugging me. I can't quite put my finger on it. Really? It seems pretty simple to me. Her forehead, don't destroy what little respect I have for you. Oh, I'd done that years ago. I was expecting something a little more uh, sensible. This is what are you. This is a good. This is what I'm saying is good, Clavier. Please. <laughs> what I'm saying. I guess I was wrong. Good. What's this all about, Prosecutor Gavin? His simple story simply makes no sense. Think! That night, my guitar caught fire, yes. The cause may have been this, indeed. However, the guitar caught fire during the second set. Ah! That's right! Of course! Indeed. Yet the shooting happened during the third set. The two are utterly unrelated. Hmm. Yes, that must have been what was bugging me. The whole premise for this is faulty. See? His story makes no sense. Are you sure about that? Are you sure about that? Are you sure about that? <laughs> <laughs> Are you sure about that? <laughs> Are you sure about that? What exactly do you mean, Mr. Justice? 
Maybe it's not the premise for my explanation of the switch that it's, that's at fault. Maybe it's our premise for this entire case so far! What premise is this, specifically? I'm glad you asked. I'm saying that maybe the killing didn't p take place in the third act! Objective! What's this? But Detective Emma Sky heard shots and found the body. Yeah, but... All of this happened in the third act. Objection! Gunshots rang out. And, according to his testimony, Machi was in that dressing room at the time. Where are you going with this, Mr. Justice? Stay with me, Your Honor. He also told us in his testimony, namely, that the victim had already been shot. We all heard gunshots, but no one saw the shooting. This... this is insane! Just before the shooting took place, the shooter was heard on his headset, telling someone to press the switch. The next moment, Prosecutor Gavin's guitar burst into flame. We know that a remote trigger igniter was hidden inside that guitar. From all these facts, we can draw only one conclusion. The crime did not take place during the third act. But during the ballad performance, the second act. What? Order! 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 That's a good twist. I like that twist. Yeah, that's a good one. But that goes against the evidence. What does, Your Honor? This crime was carried out according to the lyrics of that song, yes? Hey, she's right. Look. The bullet is supposed to come after the fire. Okay, but yeah, that's a song, and this guy's <laughs> dead, so... The killer could have simply, oh, I don't know, done it out of order on purpose. Yeah, maybe they're trying to <laughs> obfuscate the murder, you know? You guys are all crazy. You know, what, you nobody would do, nobody would have done that. But... Yeah. You're thinking this about it the wrong work. way. Huh? Look, why would the shooter craft the events of that day to follow the lyrics anyway? It's an awful lot of trouble to go through. With little merit for the per with little merit for the person doing it. Well, I'm sure whoever it was had some reason. Yes, they did. A reason that made it advantageous to follow the, l the lyrics. You're saying the order was reversed on purpose? Hmm? Reversed, Prosecutor Gavin? Reverse, reverse. If the criminal followed the lyrics strictly, then yes. The shooting would have had to come after the guitar burst into flame. Yet her forehead has raised another possibility. He's claiming that the bullet came not after, but just before the fire. <laughs> Guys, we know this. Yeah. <laughs> Couldn't have put it much better myself. You did just put it that way yourself, like, <laughs> one minute ago. <laughs> Wait, what? Are we not in a flashback right now? Huh. <laughs> I, I, I'm still saturated with color, but... A habit of doing I, it out loud for some reason. <laughs> I can't tell where the reality begins and the flashbacks end. <laughs> we were only meant to think that the shooter came after the... We were only meant to think that the guitar... Motherfucker. We were only meant to think that the shooting came after the guitar burst into flame. That was the criminal's objective. The crime followed the lyrics to a point, but that was the ruse. Why else would the killer risk discovery by moving the body? Also, hey, we get this screenshot. Uh, also, hey. Yeah. Also, hey. Why haven't we talked about how unlikely it is that <laughs> Machi moved the body? <laughs> Why do hey, we not hey, let bridge. us bring this up? Hey, Pridge. Now he can see and speak English, so I think it's pretty more likely that he did it. <laughs> um, also, somebody pointed this out in the, I think the YouTube comments, or it might have been in the, the, the chat, but uh, he is absolutely doing the Yamcha death pose, and that's incredible. <laughs> Oh Mashi, yeah. You can see, you can speak, and you can lift. <laughs> <laughs> it's the it's the fucking fairly odd parents. 
I yeah. can see! Uh, I, I can fly! <laughs> How do you say gains in Virginian? <laughs> Why else would the killer risk discovery by moving the body? It's that, that hieroglyphic that I died doing the Kamehameha. Oh, that yeah, games. yeah, that makes sense. That was the, the final touch to make us think he'd follow the lyrics the whole way. Order! 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 That would explain this most unusual situation. It does! The killer changed the order of events to create himself an alibi. In other words, the killer was someone who had an alibi for the third set, but not the second! Okay, well then, yeah, get fucked, Darian. I was hoping it wouldn't come to this, but sadly it has. During, during that set, I sent Darian out for ice cream. <laughs> so it couldn't he said that he would take him. a little bit longer because he also had to pick up milk and sing. <laughs> <laughs> I lose more Ace Attorney characters that, that way. I think that was the last we ever saw of Darian. <laughs> <laughs> and we have a witness to this. Valent Grammarly. <laughs> what? Let me tell you why your little fairy tale makes no sense at all. Oh, it sounds good, I'll give you that. You've given us a reason why the killer bothered following the lyrics of my song. But I question your logic. For it's flawed from the very beginning. Oh, come on. Flawed? Yeah, uh, hypo hypothetically, for the sake of argument. <laughs> let's, say the killer, let's, let's say the kill happened in the second act. Ah. Uh... <laughs> Yes, a contradiction, <laughs> Herr Forehead, one I've pointed out several times, no less. At the time of the crime, the small window at the scene was closed. <sighs> How could Lamiwa have heard a voice through it? Oh. I know that you would like to divert our attention from this critical fact. But she literally just testified about this. Why didn't you object to her? Okay. But you're basing your entire line of reasoning on a false premise. Right. Lemuar's testimony is my entire case. That voice she heard. The shooter's voice. What if... What if she couldn't hear it, Apollo? Look, what do we have? A man saying press the switch? And near the crime scene we have a switch which acts as a remote trigger for an igniter. And last but not least, Prosecutor Gavin's flaming guitar. It can't all be a coincidence, but how do I make it work? I see a more direct line of questioning is required. When the crime scene was investigated immediately after the crime, that window was closed. Can you tell us how Lamiwa heard the voice? A key point, to be sure. Mr. Justice, can you explain this to the court? Okay, Justice. You've got one thing to prove and one thing only. Lamiwar heard a voice. She heard it during the second set. Think, how is Lamiwar able to hear the voice? She, she has, has divine, divine hearing. <laughs> <laughs> Uh, uh, I hear everything. She was somewhere else. Yeah, I think it probably has to be that. she was somewhere else. Yeah. Probably that, because they, yeah. she's blind and she probably didn't know exactly where she was. Or, well, I guess that's true, but... I mean, it can't be the other two, is is my only yeah, real... Divine hearing's yeah. nonsense. The window was open is too obvious. I feel like we would have had this... Literally just said it was closed, so get fucked. Yeah, so I yeah. it's gotta be. Yeah, it's gotta be she was somewhere else. When we investigated the scene, the window was closed. The shooter had no reason to close it had it been open either. Meaning, it was impossible to hear the voice through that window. Ah, it's good to hear you making sense again. For a moment, I was afraid you might be a Virginian too. Dude. What, what the fuck does that mean? You know, you know what we those say about Virginians. those Virginians, right? Jesus. As I was saying... Sorry, 
Flavia's doing a cheeky little racism. <laughs> As I was saying, Lamuar could not hear the voice through the window. So there can only be one explanation. She heard that voice from another location entirely. Watch this. <laughs> you do amuse me so. And here I thought you and Good Sense were back on speaking terms. <laughs> now, I'm afraid you and Good Sense speak two entirely different languages. We, we get it. Yeah. Shall I interpret for you, Herr Forehead? No, I hear you don't have interpreters <laughs> here. <laughs> <laughs> Lamiwa clearly stated she heard the voice through that small window. And there is only one small window at the scene. Are you sure? Think about it. Isn't there another small window at the scene? The window to the soul? <laughs> the window and the window of the divine? Which only the, Lamy Walker can Isn't know there? <laughs> <laughs> you know what, Clavier? There's actually a small window right here in this court. <laughs> Just look at your chest! I was gonna There's say, a boob window clearly visible! I was gonna say the window to the wall. And I but... bet I could hear something if I put my ear up <laughs> <laughs> There is? I know that look. He wants us to ask him. <laughs> Very well. You claim Lamiwa heard the voice from another location? The judge is just like, man, I've had this guy for literally two cases, and I can't stand him already. <laughs> <laughs> Mr. I Justice? Hope replace him. <laughs> <laughs> I hope the viewers don't like him and want the old guy back. <laughs> <laughs> Mr. Justice, show us where this location was. Lamiwa heard the voice from here. Uh, 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 from inside the coat on the hanger. Uh, <laughs> oh, uh, the, uh, oh yeah, yeah, you can look across. Okay. Um, um, wait, oh, is it the uh, speaker outside? She was Oops, in the. Fridge. I was in the vent. I didn't realize. <laughs> oh, hey, Machi, what are you doing here? Uh, I mean, maybe like because. The oh wait no never mind. Hmm. Oh, did the bullet holes go through the wall? I think they're lodged I in forget. it. I forget because otherwise they would have absolutely hit Emma and Apollo as we were standing right outside that door at the time. <laughs> well, technically it would have it was faked, but um. <sighs> Yeah, fuck. Was she in the vent? No, she couldn't have been in the vent. Because <sighs> that would be silly, and... I feel like it has to... I feel like the bullet holes went through the wall. Or the bullets went through the wall. Hmm... Do we have, like, evidence that we can look at that... I mean... Oh, yeah, we can't look at evidence right now, can uh, we? <laughs> oh, no, I didn't... Fuck. Oh. She heard it through the television. The TV. God <laughs> fucking. This is Persona 4 now. <sighs> Does this look like a small window to you, Mr. Justice? The state of modern society can be read from numerous objects and artifacts. In a sense, anything can be a window on our society. Damn. I didn't ask you to point out a window on society. I want a window on the crime scene. No points for trying? Okay. No, no points for trying. Hey, pull, up, pull up the court record really quick. Uh, oh yeah, before we get out of this. Um, right, this look, at the, look at the gun. Does the gun say anything about... No. No. Damn. You can actually look at it, which... I don't know if we... Could we do that before? Yeah. Yeah. Could. Yeah, because yeah, we, we yeah, saw... We, we, looked in the, we looked in the chamber. Roach... Oh, her brooch was found in this room. That's true. On the left side. Oh yeah, that's um, true. Well, then how did it? I guess that really that kind of does point 
to the vent. To the vent. Yeah, I, I right think there. it actually is the vent. Oh, that's right, because it's about the magic trick. It's so yeah. it is the vent. Uh, yeah, 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 yeah. Only one other thing. Heard the voice from here. Eh. Eh. This is where Lamiwar heard that voice from. But that's no small window, that's the air vent! Motherfucking everybody vented in this fucking case. What she did what what did she tell us? She said she's a Virginian, unfamiliar with our language. It's not a stretch to imagine that she called this air vent a small window. I <laughs> Listen Now you've done it. Among Us came out, she that? definitely would have known the word for vents, come on. <laughs> <laughs> Now you've done it. You've gone beyond ridiculous and into... Ludicrous! <laughs> Luda! Luda! So Lamiwa was up in the ventilation system listening to this man's voice? That's the only logical explanation, yes. Logical? I do not think this word means what you think it means, Herr Forehead. Listen, hey, I speak Princess English, Pride so... Reference. Yeah. Okay, what about it isn't logical? It hardly merits saying! Why would Lamiwa be in the ventilation system? Hiding like a rat? No offense intended to her, of course. I think you've done plenty of that. <laughs> <laughs> that does not reflect my views on the Virginians as a God whole, okay? Damn. Also, also... Alexander V in the chat. In Virginia, we call venting windowing. <laughs> <laughs> they windowed. That's not windowed. <laughs> I saw him window. The explanation for that is simple, Prosecutor Gavin. Isn't it, Lamiwar? You have been listening to our discussion here, yes? Yes, through the small window in front of me. <laughs> I admit it, it's had me quite confused since yesterday. Yes, the small window was closed. But why should that mean I could not hear through it? Oh. Uh... I feared our prosecutor might himself need an interpreter. <laughs> okay, okay, I get why she insisted that she still heard it now. Yeah, that makes sense. The problem here is words. Get rid of them, I say. <laughs> Who cool. needs them? <laughs> we don't need words anymore. What's the name of that words. movement? What do they mean? That's like, we should simplify language to the point that there's only one word for everything. It's not well, good. I don't think that would be very helpful. No, it's, yeah. it's... I mean, that's one thing about Chinese that's that blows my mind is that, like, inflection means different things. Mm. Like, oh, the, same, the same... Series of syllables, but said in a different inflection and mean, mean a different completely word, different. Wow, which is wow. yeah, which is wild. Yeah, to think about. I mean, we kind of have that. I can say something is shit or yeah. shit. Yeah, <laughs> yeah, that's shit. <laughs> Lemuar, this small window through which you heard the voice was it up high on the ceiling of the room, not low on a wall? Yes, it was up on the ceiling. We got him! Boom. What?! Order! Order! I will have order! Witness! You will clarify this statement to the court! Are you in fact saying that you were above the ceiling of the room? And that's where you heard the moment of the crime! Yes, in fact I was. I'm sorry, I never imagined it would become such an important point. Yes, well... Why the heck were you up there? I mean, Apollo, you know. God, yeah, do you guys not know what she was doing during the second set? Like, Are you not? <laughs> not I believe not it's anything. time for another testimony. I... I'm not sure I... I can't. Right, and you have a magical NDA that you can't talk about this with. May I remind you, this is a murder trial? This is a murder trial. <laughs> we will hear your testimony. 
Oh, thank you. I need a reminding of that. <laughs> Tell us why you witnessed the crime from above the ceiling of that room. Wait, what kind of crime again? <laughs> a murder! <laughs> Please. Well, looks like I'm on the right track. I was going to say, this might be a good stopping point because it's almost 10. Well, there's technically a pause in the middle of the trial, and I'd like to get us to get there, but... Mm -hmm. We, okay. We got we got we got two cross two more testimonies, but I think the first one's short. Okay. Um above the ceiling. Yes, I was above the ceiling when I heard the voice. I don't know why. When I first saw this, I thought she was like floating in the vent. The way she she's like hunched. It makes yeah, her look like a hunchback. Yeah. yeah this like is a huge like vent. This yes. is also a huge vent, yes. This is not like a John McClane you can crawl through. This is yeah. a whole lot you can stand through if you can stand in it. <laughs> yeah, someone lives in this vent. <laughs> this is a tiny home. <laughs> I had heard there was a, a small window there before. Yeah, you could charge but it's in California, so the rent's still Damn like... Damn it, I was about to say, you could charge $2,000 a month for this uh, vent in, <laughs> in New York. <laughs> It was in the middle of my performance. I had no time to report what I had heard. As to why I was there, I cannot say. I am bound to secrecy on this matter. It, it's part of the magic trick. Like it, it's not even like that. Like saying that would even be like revealing the whole, whole secret. It's just pretty obvious. Yeah. You're there for the magic trick. Yeah, I was gonna ask. Uh, can you be required? If you by make the, court the magician reveal NDA? their secret. <laughs> yes, you can absolutely break an NDA if a court requires you to. Okay. If, if it's if it's a matter of if it's a matter of uh, policy like this, the cool. same way that like no. the same way that like you know, again, and things like trade secrets, you can obviously limit who can hear. You, you know, you can limit audience allowance. You can right. Limit the degree it gets out. You can make it so only the required parties hear it if it's truly a secret that that needs to be protected. But like yeah, what you they can break an NDA tried to do with the Google doc Google uh, lawsuit where. A bunch of weird random shit from Xbox got leaked and stuff like that. Yeah, exactly. So, Witness, can you please tell me what the next Sonic the Hedgehog game will be <laughs> by any chance? <laughs> can you well, give actually, us the release to date to the Nintendo <laughs> Switch 2? If, if you watch today, Sony, stay to play. Yeah. You know what the next Sonic game is. <laughs> I do indeed. It's true. Bound to secrecy? In my line of work, one has many obligations to uphold. But you say you were in the middle of your performance. So this did happen during the second set. I did not witness the crime, you must understand. I only know what I heard. Yes, but you must tell us what you were doing in detail. That's what the cross-examination is for. Yeah, hair forehead? <sighs> Our mission in this court is to discern the truth. No obligation, no binding pact may hinder that mission. Hmm. Very well. Mr. Justice, you may begin the cross-examination. What are you going to do, Apollo? Try to prove that it's related to the magic trick. I'm going to find the truth. Thing we do every night, Trucy. <laughs> <laughs> Try to take over the truth. Law. <laughs> she was up there. She was up above the ceiling for a reason. I just have to get it out of her. Ah, yes. <laughs> Maybe if I shake her, it'll come out. <laughs> Voice. There was a small window there before. In the middle of my performance, I had no time to report what I had heard. As to why I was there, I cannot say. Please, can you though? Uh, you heard the gunshots during the second set. During your performance, you're quite sure. Yes. Why would I lie about the time? You've lied about a lot of things. <laughs> Why didn't you tell us this yesterday? 
No one asked me. <laughs> God she damn said it. it. <laughs> I thought you all knew. <laughs> Don't gaslight me! <laughs> <laughs> what? I'm not gaslighting you. I think you're just crazy. <laughs> <laughs> uh, uh, you're probably right. This is a very interesting <laughs> arrangement of letters <laughs> to make a harumph sound. I sing hamburger. <laughs> Maya jumps through the wall like the Kool-Aid man. <laughs> Did somebody just say hamburger? <laughs> I told you Machi was not the killer. Oh, maybe I'm not saying it right. Machi is the killer. Not. <laughs> oh, I yo, told goal this hit many times. Oh shit! Yes, we hit the goal, folks. Oh, nice. Uh, please be excited. Ember oh! has been working on it already. Uh, so hopefully, in the next month, we will do the uh, the the new more poorly new translated, translated Ace Attorney. Ace. Yeah, it'll be the yeah. second one with Edgeworth and everything. Uh, that's also the updated autopsy oh report god. case, I think. Yes, oh it is. Oh my gosh. I'm very yes. excited to see that. The updated corpse <laughs> results, as they were in the first case. <laughs> <clears throat> yes, you did. But you never told us why. I'm sorry. I was not able to speak of it. Unable? Or unwilling. Volant is hiding in the gallery with a sniper trained <laughs> on her right now. <laughs> yep, just uh, just the scope a little Keep bit. Silent. Just a little, Take just a, a little red light just appears on her. Step to the left. <laughs> <laughs> oh, everybody's looking. Let me hide it in my top hat. <laughs> <laughs> this is my magic gun. <laughs> Watch me make a witness. Disappear! Disappear. <laughs> <laughs> She's not talking, Apollo. What do we do? We'll just have to prove it ourselves. As long as she's bound by this pact of silence, she won't talk. But if I can prove why she was up there, she'll have to admit it. Okay. But how are you going to do that? She was singing on the stage, no, Apollo. No, she wasn't, Trucy. Got a theory as to why, too. A chord theory. Maybe I've... And maybe I've got the evidence to prove it! Bound to secrecy as to why I cannot say. That's right. I, Apollo Justice, am taking over the Game Theory channel. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know if it's this statement or the other one but it's definitely the tape we don't have anything about the magic trick do we not yet apart from the tape um, the tape itself yeah, yeah which i feel like it's gotta be eh, as to why i was there yeah okay it's probably this one okay good lamiwar truth be told the reason the reason for your presence above that ceiling is quite clear especially when you consider what happened during your performance Happened. Yes, it's all right here on this video. Okay, this one definitely oh counts. God. Mm -hmm. Yes. Oh God, are we gonna be able to finish this? We have to watch this uh, tape a couple times. <laughs> Still so funny. As we can see, Lamiwar was clearly not on the stage for her entire performance! Uh... Though it sends me to be so realistic, Lamiwar is incapable of actually vanishing, let alone teleportation! So the only explanation is that she was hidden from view, and during that time she moved to the back of the forum. What, Juicy? It's not nice to reveal a magician's secrets, and it's against the rule. But I'm a lawyer. I'm not supposed to be nice. This is all very fascinating. But how is it possible? There is only 20 seconds between when she disappears and reappears. She couldn't have moved that fast. 
Or could she? <laughs> Lamuar v. Pearls foot race. Who wins? <laughs> it was me, Lamuar. I moved so fast that I <laughs> I broke the guitar and killed him. I went back in time and you know. <laughs> it was me, Barry. <laughs> <laughs> Is something wrong, Prosecutor Gavin? This was his concert, his show. He knows how the illusion was performed. Aha! It's just realizing his own oversight. Let's look at the cross-section diagram again. Here, we can trace a route through the ceiling. It goes, th it goes from the stage, through the backstage, to the rear of the forum. Ah. Ah. Uh -huh. um. Recall Lemuar's testimony from yesterday. I was on my way from the stage to the backstage exit. There was something like a little window there. That's how I saw it. Okay, I got it. I'm sending it in our group chat. Hell yeah. Yeah. He went from the stage to the backstage <laughs> exit. So add, that, add that in uh, art for stream, too. That's really good. Yeah. <laughs> I, I, credit to anyone who remembers Fuck. this classic meme. The fucking cat in the ceiling meme. <laughs> yeah, that's good. A perfect description of this route above the ceiling. Lemuar knew of this because of her part in the illusion, but she wasn't the only one who knew. What? Just now, in the lobby, Machi told me something. Run. <laughs> Messiah! <laughs> <laughs> I started to like you, so I'm gonna warn you. <laughs> I know if I opening vent, I can leave stage and back. Backstage. She said that? Oh, were you not informed, Prosecutor Gavin? I... I knew about the Vanishing Act, of course. Yet I had no idea of the route that would be used. Why didn't that magician tell me? <laughs> Hmm. Magicians only reveal details of their acts on a need-to-know basis. And you didn't need to know. Yeah. Vine boom. They're the bread and butter of a magician's life, you know. They're the milk and cigarettes of a magician's <laughs> life. <laughs> Which is why he bound Lamuar to secrecy. Well, Lamuar! I'm impressed, Mr. Attorney. Machi was right about you. What did he say about me? So... I don't want to know. <laughs> what does this mean? <laughs> Are you me saying you lost. use this root above the ceiling? What was the defendant's name again? <laughs> I did. Well, that's that. <clears throat> but I'm still a little confused. Why is that, Your Honor? As I said before, I thought it was going to flash back to the judge. <laughs> <laughs> there was very little time between when she disappeared and reappeared. Again, she's really fast. 20 seconds, tops. How could she do it so fast, especially if she stopped to hear the shooter's voice? That... that's a good question. I love the confidence on the like 20 seconds top. Yeah. 20 tops. <laughs> Fight me if you disagree. <laughs> I'll throw you in jail. <laughs> can the witness explain this to the court? I cannot. Very well, Mr. Justice. Yes. It's all up to you. <laughs> do your thing. I was afraid you were going to ask that. Um, Julie, do the thing. <laughs> what thing, Your Honor? 
You need to explain how Lamiwa was able to teleport like she did. Or I'm throwing your case out with the bathwater. Uh, why do I get picked on? It's Lamiwar who isn't going along with the program here. As I have stated before, I am not at liberty to speak of the illusion that night in detail. Then you'll just have to tell us what you can. We'll hear your testimony on this. Mr. Justice, it will be your job to wring the truth out of her. Yes, if you would, please. Please don't. Please, please ring me. <laughs> right. I've never seen a judge so accommodating to a witness. Like, <laughs> just being like, hey, could you please testify about this? No, I'm afraid no. I can't. Okay, ah, no, dang well, it. No problem. Well, Looks like you got to really pressure her into getting it out. <laughs> I feel like a student before finals. Good luck, Apollo. On your finals. <laughs> Okay. All right, this is the last one. Uh, follow the road ex exactly. As oh, sorry. Yeah, you're right. This is exactly the as was instructed. There is an emergency exit in the backstage where a stagehand waited. From there, one can enter the forum on the opposite side of, from the stage. The plan was for me to move there in two minutes. I was on my way when I heard the voice. Two minutes. That's much more than 20 mm. seconds. Yeah. Two minutes, you say? The mystery deepens. <sighs> I suppose it was too much to hope that the judge would come up with something. Would come up with something. As does my curiosity. <laughs> Take it away, Mr. Justice. Right, Your Honor. All I have to do is find the contradiction between what Lamiwar is saying. We can see plainly in the video. I figured it out already. I am a magician, after all. Well, tell me. Not a chance. Oh, come on. I can't reveal another magician's secrets, even if it ends up with an innocent person getting thrown in jail. <laughs> magician's code is that important. <laughs> hey, you're supposed to be on my side here. Big illusion. Follow the route exactly as I was instructed. Emergency exit where a stagehand waited. From there, one can enter the forum on the opposite side of the stage. Plan was for me to move there in two minutes, which is wild. I was on my way when I heard the voice. Let's ask about this. Yeah. Two minutes? Yes. It can be it can be done in one minute if you're running. Running? In that cramped dark tunnel above the ceiling? <laughs> Mr. Attorney, have you forgotten? Dark or oh lit, God. it makes no difference to me. I'm blind, by the way. Ugh, that's true, but So you're saying that on the night of the concert you made the trip in two minutes? Yes. Though I nearly didn't make it in time. You see, I stopped halfway. Lamiwar disappears in the video for 20 seconds. But she says she made the trip in two minutes! How? If you want my professional opinion, I'll bet the answer's right there in the video. Okay. Well, Mr. Justice, perhaps you have some evidence for us. Something that can explain the discrepancy between the video and her testimony? Uh, evidence explaining the discrepancy? Well, there's gotta be something. I don't know what it is. Nope, there's not. There's one piece of evidence that explains the discrepancy between the video and the testimony. And that's the video. <laughs> and that's the video. It's the thing where, like... I mean, I guess it could be, I don't know. But, I mean, the fact that Trucy was like... It's in the video. Yeah. Um, Wait, look at the look at the the map one more time. This of one? the stage. Yeah. 
So she's saying she, she went, went down, down from the little T, and then actually down there went, went down the warp that. pipe. Mm-hmm. Boop, 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 boop. <laughs> Uh, and then went over there, and then went all the way up there. Mm-hmm. Uh, hmm. Well, it looks like we'll have to watch the video again and see. Mm, let's... Oh, you can't! <gasps> God bless you, game! Oh my god! Oh, it just... No, it's... no you can only skip. Okay, I mean, it's better than nothing. Oh, it yeah. skips a lot. Nothing. No, what? Okay, so she's here. This is what I want to... Yeah. I wish they would have done the fucking... <laughs> Fast forward. Okay, so she's gonna leave. Well, okay, actually, <sighs> idea, though. Uh, this might not work. Uh, but instead of, like, clicking it once, can you hold oh. it? No. Um, uh, damn. Can I get to the moment she appears? It's like after she already appears is the next stop, which is kind of a bummer. Okay, here we go. Uh, okay. She does not have the brooch on anymore. Yeah. Is that she anything? That she, lo she lost it in I the mean, that thing. just means we're correct in that. Yeah, we know where she lost it. Yeah. What's well, like, do we present the video or do we present the brooch? I don't know if that explains anything, though. Yeah. That's true. Uh... I don't know if we do have any evidence at the moment. We might have to press more shit. Uh... We're so close. Everybody's just smiling in the chat. Yeah. That's uh -huh. that's when they're like, we want to tell you the answer, but we won't. Um. Hmm. I'm going to go with my gut. It's our lawyer. It's our attorney's badge. That's right. Mm-hmm. I'm a lawyer, by the way. <laughs> I would hope so. Lamuar. Oh shit, it was. Fuck yeah. Oh, yeah. Interesting. Do you remember what happened to this brooch? Aha! The brooch! We saw that yesterday, did we not? It was found at the scene, Your Honor. And you're bringing this up now... why? I thought we had already determined when that was dropped. So did I. But we hadn't. Take another look at this video! Wait, no, no! Wow, well, okay, yeah, <laughs> they, they definitely got us here. Here you can see that she's wearing the brooch. So she is. Let's look a bit later. Oh, is she not wearing it while she's standing on this? Di okay, well, yeah. Yeah, but does that explain a discrepancy, or is that just... What? The brooch, it's gone! What? Yes. The brooch disappeared in the short space of 20 seconds, and it takes a full minute to run from the stage to the backstage. Which means there can be only one explanation. The Lamuar we see before the Vanishing Act, and the Lamuar we see after- Wait, is this the Prestige? Are two different peep- It is the Prestige! I genuinely didn't wow. realize that. Holy shit. They prestiged me. They prestiged, they prestiged the heck out of you? What? <laughs> the brooch was found on the floor at the, at the crime scene. And not just on the floor. <laughs> But on the in the chat said, Finkel is Einhorn! <laughs> very good, very good Ace Ventura pet detective reference. But on the floor directly beneath the air vent! Lamuar, tell me, did you drop the brooch on your way from the stage to the backstage at the very moment you witnessed the crime? 
Yes, I think I did. Order! Uh, Prosecutor Gavin! From your expression, I gather you had no idea this was the case, Herr Judge. I, of course, knew about it. Shut up. What? <laughs> Shut uh, up. Don't get me wrong, I wasn't hiding it. It just never occurred to me. That's, there's no way. That the switch and the shooting took place at the same time. So, I was right? There was a switch! There was. Just before the stage's tower rose, Lamiwa was replaced. And in the chat, Lamiwa of Hazakura Temple. <laughs> <laughs> While we're on the subject, just who was this replacement Lamiwa? Why, the man behind the illusion? What? Balance Grammary. <laughs> I so, was gonna joke that's right. I was going to joke that it was Romain Latous. I'm <laughs> hot as a woman. <laughs> God, what? I shaved directly before him. Yeah, wait, what? <laughs> and then grew it back immediately after. <laughs> it's magic. You know the, you know the, uh, the like Dennis in the SpongeBob movie. Like this is a real mustache. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> 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 what? It was Grammarie. That's. Quite the illusion, but I still don't get one thing. Fucking drag icon. <laughs> yes? The switch happened before the tower rose, correct? So you weren't on the stage. That's right. But this uh, fake Lemuar is still singing. And she's pretty good. <laughs> That's true. Come on, Apollo. That's an easy one. We have technology that can pr throw your voice 30 feet. <laughs> they were just playing a recording. Lamuar can't sing, actually. <laughs> All of her stuff is auto-tuned. <laughs> Didn't you know, Paula? <laughs> the Gavinus aren't some kind of air guitar band, Fräulein. Then why do you do it in court all the time? Got him! <laughs> no, you're I'm just playing a song on the world's smallest guitar. <laughs> oh, you mean I'm wrong? When we play a show live, we play live. No recordings. Perhaps you can explain, Lamy Wong. Very well. Yes. Do tell, and add it to your testimony. God damn it. Uh, I had to keep singing even while I moved. Well, explain that yes. to us. You were singing? What, at a concert? Were you sang? Yes. Mr. Gavin expressed a dislike for recordings. So I used this. Wait. So you were singing the whole time? Even when you were crawling above the ceiling toward the backstage? Literally right I above the murderer yeah, being like, do it, do it now. Yeah, <laughs> did they not hear her <laughs> singing? Why should it matter where I sing, when everywhere I go is the same darkness? God damn it. <laughs> She's so fucking dramatic. But you know, even though all I have is darkness, I have to say, my singing was pretty lit. <laughs> <laughs> but if you were singing while you were walking... Okay, yeah, good, they bring it up. That's right. Wouldn't the shooter and victim have heard? She was singing right over their heads, after all. That is right. Are you sure? You'd have to be pretty hard of hearing to miss someone singing in the ceiling. Once again, we come back to the state of the cr of the scene of the crime. What state? Idaho. Ohio. Uh, Damn it. <laughs> I know what he means. That old speaker, Apollo. The speaker. That speaker was blaring at the time of the murder. Ah, okay. that's for monitoring the stage from this room. Monitoring? 
around the monitor? Yeah. <laughs> it pipes at a real-time feed from the stage microphones. Useful for knowing when your set is coming up. Satisfied? That dressing room was fitted with a large speaker playing a direct feed from the stage. At my request, actually. So, Lamiwar singing in the ceiling sounded just like Lamiwar singing over the speaker? Okay, I have to get like a little bit pedantic about this. Wouldn't yes. like the the feedback. The, I was the about mic... to say the feedback oh, would be terrible. <laughs> yeah, but no, maybe this is crazy technology, and no <laughs> yeah, 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 yeah. they can't they, they can't <laughs> fix so many other things. But yeah, no feedback mics anymore. Ingenious. Her voice was hidden by her voice. <laughs> Uh, Lemmywar. I have just remembered something. <clears throat> Do tell. When I heard the noise, the gunshots, yes? It startled me, so I... So you... I stopped singing. What? I forgot the words I was supposed to sing. The song... Stopped? Thankfully, it was the very beginning of the second verse. So, not many would notice. Forehead! That mixing board I lent oh, you. God Where is it? it? The mixing... Huh? That machine, Apollo. The one that breaks music into tracks. Oh, this! I completely forgot about it. I will say, I if we do this, yeah. we probably should either skip art or stop right now. I it's so anticlimactic, but I, I actually do think we should stop because yeah, fair yeah. enough. It's it's going long. We are at ten thirty. We haven't started art yet. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That's gonna do it for another Ace Attorney with an actual liar again. Um, watch us every Wednesday at seven thirty p.m. Eastern time on uh, youtubecom team. Check out Nezumi over on youtubecom yeah. NezumiVA. And uh, check out Wes on twitch.tv slash Wespectable. But uh, until next time, court is adjourned. Starting off our, tonight, uh, Herlock Gnomes with Collage 1. Lammy War is a heartless from Kingdom Hearts. Holy shit. <laughs> wow, that's so good. That's awesome. That's uh, very good. Uh, I want to replay Kingdom Hearts 2 so badly. <laughs> Trucy and uh, Apollo and Darian is Shadow the Hedgehog. <laughs> yeah. yeah. <laughs> Giant fucking forehead. The fact, board. yeah, the fact that one of his spikes sticks forward instead is really good. <laughs> Honestly, the jacket doesn't seem unlike something he would wear. So no, yeah, it fits pretty well. <laughs> it's very edgy, like him. So <laughs> Emma Sky, with the past two weeks, I've been working on my mystery hats. The past few days, I've dished out hints as to what they are based off of. It's time for the grand reveal. Uh, Their identities yeah. are based off of Ace Attorney with an actual lawyer. Yo! Yo. Oh, oh, that's so cool! Cutie. This is so cool! <laughs> Minus the fucking banana referee shirt. That's so good. <laughs> that's a good shirt. <laughs> I have it on the oh, couch. Oh, this is great! Yo! These are awesome. A little hat mm -hmm. Yeah! Hell yeah, Emma. Bye. James with Drew Nezumi. Yeah! Yo! That's yeah. so good. Yeah. Uh huh. You got great. the you got the mug exact too. <laughs> the, uh, is that any miny on it? Uh no, I have a mug of a uh, Rena from Higurashi. Incredible, mm. incredible. <laughs> I love the the lighting on this too. Is really really good. Mm. Uh, and other Gaviners as well. Calliope as lieutenant and drummer. Cadence as the lawyer and bassist. And Harper, a crime lab technician and the keyboardist. This is awesome. These are great OCs. Nice. Yeah. yeah. The designs are like super fitting too. A cat, yo, I did a Clavier cosplay with background edits. These oh, are nice. awesome. Yeah, nice. Cool. Also shit. Very nice. That's a nice ass guitar. Yeah. And you got the exact poses too. Hell yeah. yeah. These are red. And the chain and everything. <laughs> and in the office. Yeah. Fuck yeah. These are awesome. Hell yeah. Amazing. A little end dragon with here's biblically <laughs> accurate angel volant. <laughs> <laughs>
<laughs> he wasn't supposed to be the first of them. But then Nezumi showed up, and I wanted to do something with him. I took inspo of a sprite of his that you haven't seen yet, but I don't think that counts as spoilers. Also, he ha he does have legs. He just forgets them at home sometimes. <laughs> I know <laughs> lots of things. Lots of things. <laughs> be not afraid. <laughs> the fucking birds sticking out of his yeah. armpits. <laughs> the doves, I guess. Incredible. This is okay, so good. <laughs> and here's a little animation I did. It's dumb, but I think it's funny. <laughs> Wear legs. <laughs> <laughs> legs. <laughs> Magic. <laughs> it's yo, it did the Starsky and Hutch slide over the car. <laughs> <laughs> he forgot to put him back on. <laughs> That's incredible. That's really good. <laughs> Thank you, little end dragon. And a jelly withdrew them a little while ago. Yeah, this is super cute. Ooh. I love the like, you know, perspective and like how the even the badges in the background split down the middle. Mm -hmm. Really cool. Uh, Betty Fu, with despite Art Block being an absolute nightmare this past week, I somehow managed these two decent doodles of Nezumi while I was catching up on last week's video. Yo! Uh, yeah, cutie. Yeah. This is so good. <laughs> the um, actually. <laughs> That's really good. Uh, I can finally post my piece for the zine. I'm low-key proud of this, even though the background is relatively simple compared to, the, to my other zine arts. So Whoa. pretty. This is really pretty. This is bonkers. Yeah, it's gorgeous. Yeah, yeah. the color is gorgeous. Yeah, like it, the, it, like remind water. Me of, it reminds me of like Skyward Swords art style, oh, yeah, yeah. where they use like color, like there's splashes, like pops of color mm -hmm. within the watercolor style. Yeah, this is cool. really, really good. Mm -hmm. Amazing. Love Rudu with new to the channel and loving it enjoy a Mimi Apollo yeah hey look it's the look at this <laughs> photograph meme look at this attorney's badge <laughs> if I, every time I do it makes me sag <laughs> <laughs> why did I get so gay <laughs> <laughs> I can't rhyme gay with sad damn it no <laughs> <laughs> Uh, Ever Entropy with, okay, I'm a little nervous because I haven't been doing much singing lately, but here's me singing Guitar Serenade. I hope this makes uh, this constant repeat of the song a little nicer. Also, this song is surprisingly hard to sing. Alright, one, two, three. Sugar, sugar, oh that night in your embrace When you took the keys my heart held on too so tight. Yeah, you have a really nice voice ever in Japan. a very nice yeah, voice. Yeah. But a fleeting melody. It, yeah. Wraps itself Again, like, me I wish it was sang in the game. I wish it was sang in the game yeah. so bad. Yeah. Yeah. Wow, yeah. And you get, like, like really nice vibrato on moments and stuff. Hell yeah. Yeah. Mm, awesome for for a song, yeah, it's very awkward lyrics. You make it sound very good. Exactly, yeah, yeah. Uh, yeah. Ted's and Moss with kind of a post-finals art burnout, but have these to celebrate finally being able to play Apollo Justice Trilogy on my Switch. I drew the best magical girl. Yeah. Percy. Yeah. I love this pose, too. It's it's mm -hmm. it's very creative. Listen, you can't put Trucy in a box, you know? In a box! <laughs> What's, What's in the, the box? box? <laughs> it's Trucy. It's box. not Gwyneth Paltrow's head. Uh, Asufa. Ooh, I love the colors on this. Asufa? What's up, Asufa? Oh my gosh, yeah, also Asufa. It has been yeah. so long. Yeah. yeah, it's been a minute. I think, yeah, you were like back during the, the OG days. Yeah, that was these like colors yeah, during on, during Gant. Mm -hmm. during the these Gant. colors on yeah. Apollo are so good. Yeah, and I love yeah, the eyes. Really cool. The eyes are really really sick. Fucking oh, Earthbound, Earthbound, Earthbound crossover. Bonus MS Paint doodle. Machi realizing his powers of the sun. Side that fire. you did that in MS Paint. What the heck? That's crazy. Y'all are too talented. Stop being talented. Stop it. <laughs> this is so good. I love this. Uh, Matt Pen and Guard with Ola. The amount of stuff I share in future streams is maybe going to get reduced because I have to practice for an audition. Oh, con uh, Ooh, congrats. Good luck. good luck. Yeah. Yeah, good luck. Yeah. Today's articles are uh, Case 4 1 Breakdown Spoilers. When I got the jacket, I wore. I swore I would never cosplay him, but here we are. 
he's four. The oh. way the oh, that's, yeah, yeah. It's, oh yeah, uh, the interest of the way right. you gave yourself you gave yourself anime glasses. Yes. Is so oh my good. god, yeah. that's brilliant. <laughs> <laughs> Look, and I forgot about the uh, lobster, like, getting thrown up, too, yeah. in his breakdown. <laughs> oh, made uh, more made during stream doodles. My headcanon is that Machi is trans. That's why he's sometimes in pain. He has horrible cramps. Damn. <laughs> oh, no. <laughs> Hashtag FDM Machi Supremacy. Oh, yo, <laughs> you, you put the, the, juice. the juice box. Give yeah, us more juice. <laughs> Incredible. Also, this uh, signature for Gavin is genuinely really good. Mm. Hell yeah. Awesome, awesome. Uh, Mar, with an honor of the accidental Persona 4 reference, I had to do this. <laughs> yes! <laughs> like, we're gonna have to kill this guy, Teddy. <laughs> <Aww>. <laughs> That's so good. Uh, Panic Pen! Yo! 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 That's yeah. so good! That's so good! Wow! Cute! <laughs> also, I love us in the background, like, whoa! whoa! <laughs> this is so good! Hell yeah! Uh, the, the collage of all uh -huh. of them. Wow! That's awesome, Panic Pang. Thank you yeah, so much. Uh, Toads and Moss, I'm a little nervous to post this because I'm not the best singer. Oh, snap! I also covered the oh. color serenade. Oh, oh my god! Uh, I discovered that Lamuar and I have the same singing range, which is alto. Y'all are so good, what? Really good. Yeah, again, like the oh, vibrato yeah. and everything. Mm -hmm. Oh, I really just realized that 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 pause was when the gunshot happened, right? That's why she didn't sing ah. it. That's so good. Yo, toes and Mont, I like again, both y'all go off. This is so good. Yeah. Awesome stuff. Also, like, I love your for... your OC character wearing Lamuar's uh your yeah. self-insert character wearing Lamuar's outfit. Uh Mocha, yo, very rush doodle yo. at 4 a.m. I suddenly felt overtaken with the urge to draw one of Nesmi's portraits because they're so cute. Oh, wow. Also, I couldn't find the image on the mug, so I put a PNG of Rain and Mug over the mug. Take it or leave it. <laughs> <laughs> you know what? Fair enough. <laughs> also, hi Nesmi. I'm somewhat longtime fan, somewhat of a longtime fan. The Tengen bits from your DR3 video live in my head rent free. God, those were really good. <laughs> Fucking Tengen. Uh, and Chrono Wizard, with my art done for this case, though, since these are based off some earlier trial stuff, we'll probably need another week. Might squeeze some more next time. Machi Tobai, better known as the Pixie of the Arpeggio, Your Honor. <laughs> hey, he's a Pixie of. Uh, are pregnant? <laughs> no, Trucy, <laughs> prego! It's a sauce! Oh. <laughs> I'm going to jail. <laughs> Fuck, I forgot about He's the pixie of the pregnant? Of the pegonate? <laughs> <laughs> I love that fucking video. Gananon? Pregante! 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 Geeter! Geeter! Done! That's shockingly. Oh, this is a. This is a. Uh, Game Grumps bit. Is it actually? Yes, it is. It's like. It's a. It's. Uh, it's the Prilosec bit. It's very funny. It's a very I good bit. It is. Geeter! Done! That's shockingly like what Darian's like. I mean, almost word for word, Miss Sight. Snackoos! Eat those things? <laughs> Consume Snackoos! <laughs> that face is so good. <laughs> yeah, it's the Consume Prolisic! <laughs> Man, this is the Chili's. <laughs> And then, Only uh, a child could have fit in that vent. Hmm, but Trucy's childlike. She'd be able to. Uh, ha 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 Truce. Ha. Apollo, shut the FK up. <laughs> We're on the same side, you 
idiot. <laughs> and then uh, lastly. <laughs> oh, the siren! That's what he meant. P Polly, that <laughs> case was years ago. <laughs> oh, wait, why are you the bearded one? I don't know, Apollo! <laughs> I don't know! <laughs> it is Cena. It is Cena. Uh, should I be here? <laughs> uh, 